Hey YouTube, it's LR Jones 21 here with an action figure review. And here we have Captain America the First Avenger, comic series heavy artillery, Captain America. Um, you can see right here that it says it comes with the launching missile, which I don't have with him. The reason being that I let my little brother borrow it and basically he lost it. But if you do want to see it, move the camera up here. That's what it looks like. It's basically just a blue missile with red fins. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, quick look at the packaging. This is the back card. Um, you can see the other figures in the in the series. Oh, series one. Here we have Ultimates Captain America, Winter Soldier, and Battlefield Captain America. I do have um, sorry, I do have these two right here. I don't have that one yet, but I will have them soon. And um, I'll review them all for you guys. Here's the uh, the read up. Uh, I'm not going to read it, so if you guys want to pause the video, go ahead right here. Should we get a better view of that? There. And that's pretty much it. For packaging, he is um, number two in the series. Um, so yeah, just put that aside and have an actual look at the figure here. And, I mean, he's a great figure. You know, you can get him pretty good poses here. As you can see. So, let's just get him out of that pose. Let him stand up straight. And there we go. So, um, first thing we're going to look at is his shield. Whoops, he fell. I just put him off to the side. And you can see here that it's a really nice detailed shield. Well, a really nice painted one. Really shiny paint that they used, kind of metallic in a way. The white part here is actually not even white, it's it's like a silver paint, also this on the star. And look at the back, you see a little clip that clips onto Captain America's arm. And it also has a peg there. And the reason for that is, it's a hole in the back of um, Captain America right there in the middle of the star that you just plug in. And you can have Captain America with a shield on his back. Looking pretty badass, so. There's that. Just take the shield, put it to the side. And have a look at the figure. Set up the camera. There we go. And. He's a really nice detailed figure. Really nice sculpted. Get a look at the upper part of him. Every, you know, he has the scales right here. All of them are individually raised. The star is sculpted on. A really nice head sculpt. The wings. Um, ears, too. Um, the paint on, paint on it's pretty okay. It's like a nice navy blue. And, um, you know, see on the belt, too. Um, paint apps on this figure aren't that bad. As you can see right there there sorry has a little paint smudge on the belt from the belt loop and on the back one of the stripes but nothing major that's pretty much it nice 360 of the figure and for as of um as for articulation has a ball jointed neck a ball hinge shoulder no bicep swivel but he does have a ball hinge elbow no wrist swivel or glove swivel he does have a diaphragm joint does full 360 Not, nothing at the waist he has a ball hinge hip thigh swivel double hinge knees and a ball hinged ankle with peg holes so if you do have stands you can put them on a stand if you want to but I mean see right there he stands pretty good on his own so I mean pretty much the overview on this figure he's a really nice figure to get you know from the first series he's the most the more um, recognizable Captain America in the series you know that you have um, I mean all of them are pretty much you know you can tell they're Captain America but this is the one that's like really iconic looking with his really nice shield right here I think he has one of the nicest shields out of all the figures if you haven't seen them yet. 
you can pretty much pick up this figure at Toys R Us, Walmart, to um, Target, anywhere they really have a toy section because they're pretty much everywhere. Um, they they go for pretty much like around eight dollars, nine probably after tax, but I, I'm pretty sure like eight something, almost nine, which is not that bad for these. So yeah, I mean if you like it, you go out in stores, go look for them. They mostly have series two out and three, so it might be a little hard to find this one. For in particular, I haven't really seen this one um, recently, but. I'm pretty sure you go, you'll go, you find them. So yeah guys, uh, I'll be doing more action figures reviews. So if you guys want to subscribe, go ahead, comment, rate, whatever. It's all good. So thanks a lot.